In the ecosystem of businesses, consulting companies occupy a pretty important but delicate position. They have to balance the interests of their customers uh, with their own. And their product uh, is an amalgam of repeatable components that get commodified as well as value-added services that have to be invented every time. My name is David Orban and this is The Context, Season 4, Episode 11. I recently joined Beyond Enterprises as Managing Advisor. Beyond Enterprises is an advisory firm, so contrary to some other companies, being an advisor at an advisory firm is an operational role. As managing advisor, I see and oversee uh, the operations of Beyond Enterprises that specializes in helping projects succeed in the field of blockchain at 360 degrees. The founder of Beyond, uh, Brad Yassar, and I have worked together on many projects uh, in the past. And I am uh, excited uh, to see from the inside the workings of uh, this firm. Beyond has been very successful in, over the course of uh, several years uh, it uh, helped dozens and dozens of clients succeed uh, with a market capitalization combined for these clients that is now over $14 billion. Now, what is important in my view as a consulting company is to make sure that you correctly balance the reusable components and the unique value-added components of your activities with the clients in a reliable way where the correspondence between the initial analysis and the proposal that embodies that analysis and the reality of day-to-day -day implementation is as good as possible, even when, obviously, as it happens all the time, there are challenges, there are changes, there are necessary adaptations along the road. The opportunity is really very big because obviously every company has the um, choice available to them if they want to internalize some new technology. But exactly because technological change is accelerating, actually the rate of acceleration is increasing and technologies are jolting, it is harder and harder to actually keep up and to decide that it is not only reasonable but necessarily to internalize a certain set of capabilities. Uh, even more so when uh, it happens that you are not uh, certain of what direction to take, uh, then the decisions made without external help are uh, even more difficult. Blockchain is an exciting field. It uh, comes and goes, ebbs and uh, flows, uh, excites and uh, lets down. And there are people who uh, feel that they shouldn't really touch it exactly because of uh, this uh, huge volatility perfectly represented by the exchange rate between Bitcoin and 
uh, the US dollar or uh, the euro. But there are others who realize that blockchain and Bitcoin, Ethereum and all the others are here to stay. So yes, they can delay the moment uh, that they will concretely embrace it, analyze and understand how to incorporate it in their business processes. But sooner or later that moment will come. It is a little bit like uh, it happened with the, with the internet 20 years ago or more. There were people who were not at all sure that uh, it would be necessary to have an e-commerce website uh, or even something as simple as an email address. Maybe there are still holdouts, uh, but they have become vanishingly small. And from an economic point of view, the businesses that uh, proudly uh, keep away from the internet, uh, electronic commerce, uh, transactions, or even just plain and basic digital communications, well, run the risk of uh, going extinct. So Beyond Enterprises is there to help those clients that are convinced of the value of blockchain and want to start a project that embraces it and creates value. Creates value in many possible ways. And of course, we are still finding out how many of these ways are there. What is indeed possible? The closest application of blockchain technologies are those in the world of finance and payments and banking and we are very actively exploring them. As a matter of fact, uh, Beyond also has uh, projects that uh, it uh, incubated and they have become very successful. Uh, one of these to the point that Brad, the founder, felt the need to <laughs> join the project and become CEO of what is now Equify, a fully licensed crypto bank offering both traditional banking uh, solutions as well as DeFi, decentralized finance solutions in uh, the same platform. A very unique proposition. And the uh, opportunities are not stopping there, of course. In a world where the technology changes so fast that companies cannot build it inside and deploy it through their own resources alone, the very barrier between what is inside and outside the company uh, dissolves. And that means that companies that embrace decentralization and understand how to leverage it thrive better. This is not even the question of uh, localized workforces in an office versus remote workers that can be anywhere in the world. As a matter of fact, Beyond is a globally uh, distributed uh, company uh, with the teams uh, both in Asia and Europe and uh, uh, America. However, what I am talking about is the relationships that make companies, initiatives successful. And if the distinction between inside and outside is dissolved, this means that consulting companies play a fundamental role in an increasing number of um, functions and services, projects and initiatives that need to be carried out in order to be competitive whatever the brand and the logo represents traditionally. So how this uh, can managed depends obviously in the skills and the talent of the people 
who are uh, running the projects, whether on the side of the client or on the side uh, of the consultant. But they also depend on the tools. And using modern tools of collaboration and coordination is important. There are things that without those tools couldn't be done. You could not coordinate the activities of a globally distributed workforce with fax machines or telegraphs or the Pony Express. You can leverage the infrastructure that is available in order to run these new types of organizations thanks to the tools that we have now available. Similarly, knowledge management. What is the corpus of shared understanding on which the client company together with the consultant can act matters and managing this dynamic, evolving, rapidly changing corpus of knowledge is as important as the communication and coordination tools. It is fascinating and creating value like we have been able over the past several years to the point where now the combined market value of uh, our clients at Beyond Enterprises is in excess of $14 billion is exciting, accelerating, and something that makes me proud. I am looking forward to see what comes next, how we can evolve the tools, evolve knowledge management, evolve how we care for our clients. And I invite you to not only follow beyond itself, but to make sure that you understand how these tools and how these processes evolve in the world at large because they occupy a unique, delicate, but fundamental place in our economy.